Hi everybody, this is Joe with Joe's Premium Firewood, bringing another fun-filled, exciting video. Today's video, I'm at my log supplier Herb's Landing, and I just want to show you the operation he's got going on here. This is where I've been buying all these oak logs. Now look at that. Look at all these blocks. He just put the bucket onto his skid steer. He's going to scoop some of these up. Some of them are like three foot diameter. He's got Dave over here cutting them up. You know, he stages them out here for for them, you know, spread out. See, this is how you got to cut it. Because this is how he bought the logs. See that big pile there? Well, it went all the way, all the way down here. So, um, and this, they got about half of it cut, maybe. Then, there's another pile right there. Look at all that. And most of this is old. Now that log right there is cherry. I'm gonna go build her. I just give it. They're using this Husqvarna saw. You can see they marked them out with a Mingo marker. I think that's a cherry log he's cutting right now. Look how nice some of this stuff is. That's just beautiful, premium. Don't get no better than that. I'm gonna get I'm gonna get you back over here. This is what the video is about. I'll go back over to Dave here in a second. I want to show you how he does this. He's pretty good and delicate with it. Doesn't want to dent or scratch the truck. And uh he's been taking those uh yeah, he's been setting those uh box elder pieces over and then he just burns that. So he's already got a couple in. There's some boiler wood in there, but sometimes you know what what's if that's in the way it gets it gets scooped up a lot easier than me bending over and have to pick them off does that now once it starts getting high in there I'll start knocking them over and pushing them into the corners and whatnot but those are all oak in there right now I think that one might be maple though yeah that one's maple but as Dave cuts it off he's just been building this mountain of wood and he's gonna haul all this stuff back to his house he's gonna haul this back to his house and then uh, process it there but he's gonna bring me a few dump truck loads of it. See how delicate he is with that? There we go, and then, it, then he keeps the dirt in it. So he's doing a real good job. You know, some of these I might have to push into the corner. Trying to fill out the holes as much as possible. Must have found another box elder. Coming up for another scoop. There's a couple oak logs you got. A big load right there. You know, I'm sure that pieces are 80, 90, maybe 100 pounds each. Set this up right here. You guys can watch for a second. I'll uh, straighten them out because once it gets kind of high in there, you know, it's hard for them to get them to go in. So I'll just push them around.
Lawrence. Folks, that look good. Did you 
run a ride behind me. This one I might have to adjust. You know, yeah, there are a few holes in here. I have to straighten it out. But I know some of this wood is dirty, you know. It's been laying on the ground. But yeah, see how he does that? And I think he's gonna save the bigger ones for him. He's got that, that splitter with the tongs. So, good looking load though up here, isn't it? See how quick that went? If I had to pick them up by hand. I'm sure he probably runs a skid steer better than Dimitri. I know that for a fact. So, this is gonna be my winter wood. I'll be buying a, a lot of it from him, what he can sell me. Yeah, he will be bringing some with his dump truck. So, all right, folks, thanks for watching. We'll see you guys at the next video.